Cat D, and I'm here with a special announcement. Um, I was reached out to by a gentleman named Jason Urban, and he's actually starting his own subscription box, which is very exciting. I love promoting new subscription boxes. As you can see, I promoted a box on here called Toy Den Nerds. Um, that company is starting to do pretty well. Um, and Jason reached out to me, and he is going to be sending me one of Jason his boxes. reached out to me, and he's going to be sending me one of his boxes. Um, at no charge whatsoever and I'm going to be giving him an honest review for that so I want to say thank you Jason for thinking I'm of sorry me. if the light just got bad I have two dogs that are going crazy right now um, so I want to say thank you Jason for thinking of me let me tell you about this box um, so the founders box is only available for 10 or 11 more days check it out right now you don't want to miss this the founders box is going to be $60 worth of items for $25 and that is shipped unreal $60 worth of stuff for $25. Very excited about that. The best part that I think is not just going to be Funko products and the things that we get in our everyday box boxes now. Comics. Okay, so to be action figures. Um, there's going to be a whole bunch of different items. Go ahead and check out his website. I wish I would have like printed it out so I could tell you exactly what it is. But that just means you have to go check out his website and don't miss out on the Founders Box. Um, if you get the Founders Box, there's like a lifetime worth of benefits that you get apparently. Um, I think he's trying to figure out the details of that. I'm going to link everything down below that you need to know. Check it out. And next month, you'll see the Founders Box. And I'm sure you're going to be kicking yourself if you don't get one of your very own. Um, the next thing I want to do is shout out... Uh, we have a fellow YouTuber, because we all like to support this nerdy, geeky community that we are in. Uh, the NES Evolution is going to be holding his first giveaway. Um, and I know everybody loves giveaways, but we also want to support our community and support our YouTube people. And, you know, support all the effort that people put into making these videos. Um, and he needs about, he's going to have his giveaway when he reaches 50 people. And I think he's like at 42 now, so I'm going to link his channel down below. Please go support him. He's a great guy. Uh, if you want to enter his giveaway, you have to be subscribed to his channel, so go ahead and do that as well. Um, yeah, NES Evolution. So those are my two big announcements. Uh, if you want, please go ahead and check out both of the things that I was just telling you about. If you're excited about the... <laughs> Ultimate Nerd Box just as much as I am. Sign up for it. If you want to enter a giveaway, go subscribe and watch <laughs> the NES Evolutions channel. I have dogs all over the place. I'm sorry. So yeah, this is Cat D, guys. Uh, and I guess you're going to be watching an unboxing after this. So thanks, guys. Bye. What? What? Hey, guys. What? It's Cat D, and I'm here with surprise, surprise, another unboxing. Um, this will be my third month with this box, I think it is, and this is going to be Comic Pop Box. Um, they usually just send in this priority mailbox. Um, now, the first one that I got of Comic Pop Box was unreal. It was really, really awesome. Um, and then last month, um, I only got four items, and they said that they offered to send the fifth item, which would have been a magnet. Um, to me and I just said no go ahead and throw it in my next box I don't know whether or not they did um, this box should have five to six items I believe um, the theme this time is like magic or wizardry or something like that so um, I guess we'll get right into it uh, so I mean like I said it just comes in this priority mailbox so I'm gonna go ahead and cut the tape Arr. I try not to cut too deep in here because if this box is full, ugh. and the shirt is on top. All right, so once you cut the tape and open the box, this is what you see. Um, I believe this box is like twenty four ninety five. If you have a monthly subscription, I think you get 10% off, so it equals out to like $22.95. Um, so the very first thing I see is going to be the shirt, and it is a medium, so it is my size, and here it is. Is it cool, guys? Sweet! That is awesome. I am a Gryffindor. I guess that means I'm brave and fabulous. 
That's awesome. Yes, I am one of those people that took that quiz on like the wizarding, the wizarding side of Harry Potter or whatever, and I was a Gryffindor. Yay! Don't judge, guys. Don't judge. Okay, the next thing I see in here is, uh, it just says, well, oh, enjoy your new box, Comic Pop, and this is in every single one. Um, so the next thing I see in here is Mischief Managed, a Marauder's Map. Oh, that's awesome. It's a Harry Potter glass. It's very Harry Potter themed so far, which I am really, really happy about. So I really like that. That's awesome. I have a friend that would be super jealous of that. Okay, so the next thing I got in here is, ooh, I got a Harry Potter Lord Voldemort's pop keychain. I don't know what that was. It had nothing to do with Harry Potter. Um, but yeah, so I do not have this. I do not have it. Don't have it. And I see something that I really like. I mean, I like it all so far, but I see something that I really like. And it is The Night Before Christmas, and it is Jack Skellington. You cannot see my shirt, I don't think. Can you see it? Jack Skellington. I might like Jack Skellington. So, um, it's the Dorbs, and I don't mind some of the Dorbs, I really like the Disney Dorbs. Um, and I would guess I would consider this Disney, I'm sorry, I feel like I have hair in my mouth. And this is what he looks on the side, and this is what he looks on the front, trying to put you close, and I like that you can see the back. Um, there are chances to get Chase figures, this box is damaged. Man, it's always something. I mean... I mean, not that I really, I mean, I mean, I kind of do care, but I mean, I don't know if you guys can see this, and it's probably not their fault, but we see how it's peeling, and that's just going to get worse as time goes on, and I don't take these out of the box, so. <sighs> Alright, so the next thing in here we have is a villain's keychain! Ah, I want Maleficent or Lucifer. I really do. Um, the last time I got this, I actually got Exclusive B, which is like Zerg from um, Toy Story. This is what you can get on that. Actually, I really wouldn't mind any of them that I don't have. They all look really cool. I mean, even Captain Hook would be really cool, too. Oh, Snap Crackle. We got Cruella de Vil. Very cool. Very, very cool. So, one, two, three, four, five, and then six. So, I actually got my six items this time. Um, so, here is Have You Seen. Oh, it's so awesome. Have You Seen This Wizard? And it has uh, Sirius Black on it. So, this three, four Harry Potter items, one Nightmare Before Christmas, and. Um, I guess one Disney villain. So I know that it wasn't like all themed towards Harry Potter, but if you didn't like Harry Potter, you wouldn't like this box. Um, but yeah, so this is Comic Pop Got, Comic Pop Got, bet, 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 Comic Pop Box. We got the shirt, which is going to run you $10. We have the doors, which runs you about, let's say, $8. That's $18. These glasses are not cheap. I'm going to give this glass $8. That's $26. Then you have the little mini pop. I'm going to say that's five. That's 31. And I'm going to give this another like $3.99. So that's about $35. <coughs> um, and the box costs, um, like I said, 22 something. So that's not bad. That's actually a really good. Um, it's much better than last last month's. Um, so yeah, this is a great box. Uh, I don't know if I'm going to subscribe to them again. Not because I don't like the stuff inside, but the very first time I got this box, um, the, the Dorbs box was completely destroyed. Um, they did resend a new one at no extra charge. Um, but then the second time, they were missing an item, and uh, they, they offered to send it back out, but uh, I said just throw it in this box. Uh, and I don't see anything that was themed from last month in this box, so I'm not sure if they just on purpose gave me six items or if they actually put an extra item in my box I'm not sure 
Um, and then this time, uh, you know, the Dorbs is damaged again. I mean, it's not anywhere nearly as bad as it was before, but, I mean, we buy these boxes not just for the mystery, right? But we buy these boxes because these companies promise you certain products, and they're supposed to be new products. And they should be in good condition when they reach you. And it's not your fault as the consumer if they're not. And uh, I know I'm trying, I'm like going on a rant here, but I mean, I just want one of these boxes that I get to go, like, just to be, f just one box to have, like, no missing items or damaged products. I mean, uh, three months in a row. I mean,. I mean, I'll reach out to them, and I'm sure they'll be super nice about it and want to fix it, but do I really want to take time out of my day to fix a problem every time I get a box? There's, there's just there's a ton of boxes out there that I don't have the same problems with, but I really did love this box. I love the items in this box. This box, for me, because I like Harry Potter, I would give this box an 8 out of 10. If I did not like Harry Potter, like if someone got it thinking there was going to be more than just Harry Potter in it, maybe you guys got different things, maybe, you know, you got something other than what I did, you probably wouldn't like this box so much because it's so Harry Potter, like, dominated. But, okay, so like I said, I'm off of my rant. This is Comic Pop Box. Uh, let me get, let me know what you guys think. Let me tell me what your favorite item was. Tell me what you didn't like about the box. And if you like this video, please give it a big thumbs up. Like, comment, and subscribe. I'm Kat, you guys. Bye.